been to every hardware store, um, hardware store in Chicago and found anything. It's got to be in this book. All right. Let's see here now. Okay, here we go now. There have been, um, there have been two women, um, a 24 year old Asian American woman and, and a 26 year old white female they were, um, they were in this local Illinois, uh, they were in this local Illinois hardware store in Rosemont and, uh, and somehow, some way there was video, there was a video footage of them, uh, of them buying the machete and the flint as well. Wow. Yeah, I know. Oh my goodness, that sounds that sounds so unbelievable. Mm-hmm. Ooh. I got I got shivers and spines down my throat now. Well don't blame me now, you know, because it's right now, uh the only way uh The only way we're gonna find out if uh, if their fingerprints, if their fingerprints are on this flint, then we'll know for sure that these two women were um, these two women were responsible for um, for that camper lighting on fire. All right, ready for it now? Here yeah, I am. All right, let's dim the lights. All right, here we go. Put them in. All right. Impressive. Totally impressive. I'm blown away. Yeah, me too. Oh, goodness. Goodness, this is, this is by far unbelievable. Their fingerprints matches that William Price. Oh man. Now we uh now we definitely got to send that down to the Chicago authorities now. Or oh, you say. You say.